Welcome to the Mortgage Monday series. Today we're talking about the mortgage underwriting process and the documents you'll need for your mortgage application. I'm Leslie Knightley with the Turnberg and Swallow team at Coldwell Banker, and I'm here today with, off, with loan officer Louise LaRock from Fairway Independent Mortgage Corporation. Welcome, Louise. Thanks. Hi. Hi. Um, so let's talk about some underwriting questions. Applying for a mortgage can feel overwhelming. There are so many documents and so little time. Um, can you explain essentially what is underwriting and when does it happen in the mortgage process? Absolutely. Um, so initially, most clients like to do a generic pre-approval initially with that first call just to get a feel for what they qualify for and what they should be home shopping for. Some are a little bit easier than others. Um, so usually what I like to do with my clients is I like to talk a little bit about let's get you a more serious approval and that is when an underwriter would come into the picture. Um, a pre-approval or a pre-qual is just basically me running their credit and looking at their pay stub or W-2s or bank statements. An underwriting approval is the next step where a true designated underwriter for the investor signs off on that loan and says, I have reviewed the income documents, the asset documents, and the credit, and you now can purchase a home in that price level, and all that it's contingent on is the appraisal and the contract. Excellent. Um, it seems these days that the underwriting process can be more stringent. Um, it's harder to qualify for a loan. Um, can you explain why that is currently? Yes. Um, so the investors are getting much tighter in their guidelines and you have certain variable income sources, people that are self-employed and people that have overtime and it can be a very gray area of income. So when an investor who's purchasing the loan from our mortgage company starts to get much tighter on their qualifications and they don't want to buy the loan, our underwriters need to do the same. So we want to make sure right up front, before you fall in love with a home, that you're definitely going to be able to sail through quickly with underwriting with no questions asked. Excellent. Um, what we do love about your offerings at Fairway is the one day underwriting process. Can you speak to you know, how that is unique to you and how that gets done? Yes, absolutely. So oftentimes what I'll do with my prequals is I will ask my client to forward to me their most recent pay stub, their last two years income documents. Yeah. Everyone is different. So that's why our conversations can go off in so many different directions. Um, their assets or what's the source of their assets. And then we always make sure that we've looked at the credit, seen if there's anything we can do to improve the credit before you go shopping. If I have all of this information and I've input it to the loan, I can have an underwriter look at that loan within a 24 hour period and tell us that yes, you now have that approval to go to the seller and say, I truly have an underwriting approval, not just a pre-qual or a pre-approval from a loan officer who may have been in the business for a week or had been in the business as long as I have 37 years. Excellent. So it makes them a much stronger uh, buyer in that position. Absolutely. Great. Um, so if you're just getting started in your home search uh, and, pre and mortgage pre-approval, let us help. You can reach out to myself or to Louise and get you started. And, and download the document checklist we have. Uh, this is an overview of what you'll need as you apply for a mortgage. Follow the link in the description. And we want to thank you for joining us for Mortgage Monday. Hope to see you soon.